and god called us to fulfill god's plans for us devam nammale vilichirikkunathu devathinu nammale kurichulla paddathi poorthiyirikkan vendita so when we pray you can expect great things to happen i want to show you a man in the old testament who was praying his name is daniel let's go into the life of daniel daniel quickly daniel's life will take us to know him let's look into the life of daniel by the way i want you to know some of you have been working the whole day how many of you have been working the whole day one two who else three okay but how many of you feel sleepy those who are those who were working you you know i i know it's natural but others those who are feeling sleepy joli cheyad orakam feel inar etra verund anybody here okay i have been sensing a, an operation through sleep see people are working that's fine but apart from that i have been sensing a sleepiness i want you to know it's demonic thani pishadinte parivadiya but i'm not saying you are the ningal pishadikala nalla parra mummy tetti therikkil i don't call people people you are anointed people you are precious of god i won't call you demonic but remember there is a there is a you know the attitude is there are many people or there is no uh, visiting pastor so let us that nothing is going to happen visiting pastor illa adige vaalu illa adu kondu onnu samare did you hear when she prayed amma ma prathi chetra irukke attarun this really anointed there's such power jesus is here if benin is here this tremendous expectation because people's focus is on benin actually it is not benin it is god and then some names bring an expectation chala perigalu chala pratheekshagale angotu kondu varum actually jesus is here yesu undu ibide so let us pray right now and break the spirit of sleepiness ee orakkathinte aathma yesu nadana alinju pot how many of you are regulating your food during the time of fasting ee upavasathe etra vera karyamayittu kaanunna i'm not saying you should fast you know go on a no food thing but are you regulating your food doing something in this fasting endengilum cheyna aarengilu undu okay what so what what is your routine can you tell us just you're eating only one time okay okay that is great he's eating only one time mama she's eating only dinner oh you're avoiding dinner no oh, yeah yeah that's fine anyone else you're eating only in the afternoon anyone else you reduce your meals i advise you when you you know those of you are not working those who are fine, you can you know please do something with your body with your you know change something It'll definitely give you a healed uh, a change in your this thing i was telling reena from you know most probably from today or tomorrow i want to get into a complete fast because already when i don't uh, uh, when i minister god expects me to fast anyway at least when we have visiting pastors i want to get into a full three time fasting do something get into a covenant with god there are another how many days more 32 days if you can tell god lord 21 days i want to be without food on such and such a day i want to get an answer to prayer enikku prarthane get into a personal covenant with god ningal devamayittu oru nerittu oru udambadi nammal ingane prasangam kettu 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 ingane irikke chelarku adu oru aanandam aa you know for some people there is a joy listening to the word of god they don't care whatever is happening they don't care no that is not the way it is something should happen endengile sambhavikkanam i want you to know so much of by the way i want to know i am really running around to see a place for us how many of you know that nyaru salathinu vendi odi nadakka we are really running around we are seeing things we are talking to people we are going to places i am seeing trying to talk to pastors breaking through trying to get a lot of places god is doing prayer working prayer working all these things are happening supposing you get a, they are a cha, uh, with a church of with 600 people are you ready to go move it 600 perade or idinath keran ishtam undo now i tell you when you have a 40 day fasting imagine a hall where there will be three or four people like you sitting there you shouldn't feel discouraged there is a lot of psychology in that ഒരു പാട് മാനസികമായിട്ടുണ്ട് ആകപ്പാടെ പത്ത് പേരുമുണ്ട് ഞങ്ങൾ ഇതിന് അവിടെ പോകുന്നു വലിയ ഹോള് ആറ്റിറ്റ്യൂഡ് വി ഹാവ് യു നോ സൈക്കോളജിക്കലി പീപ്പിൾ ക്യാൻ ഗെറ്റ് ടയർഡ് ബട്ട് ടേൺ ടു യർ നേബർ ആൻഡ് സേ ഐ ലൈക്ക് ദാറ്റ് ഞാൻ അങ്ങനെ അല്ലെന്ന് അടുത്ത ആളോട് പറ ഇഫ് ഗോഡ് ഇസ് ഗിവിംഗ് മീ എ ഫൈവ് ഹൺഡ്രഡ് സീറ്റ് ഹി വിൽ ഫിൽ ഇറ്റ് ദൈവം എനിക്കൊരു ഫൈവ് ഹൺഡ്രഡ് സീറ്ററിനെ തന്നാൽ അവനെ നിറയ്ക്കും ഞാൻ ഒറ്റയ്ക്കോ അല്ലെങ്കിൽ അവിടെ പോയി ആരാധിക്കും ഈവൻ ഇഫ് ഐ എം എ ലോൺ ഐ വിൽ ഗോ ദർഷിപ്പ് ഓർ ആറ്റിറ്റ്യൂഡ് ഓക്കെ 
Right. So I hope you're all uh, moving in. I was about to tell you something. Yeah, okay. Let's go look into the book of Daniel. Yes, go to Daniel, please. Book of Daniel. Daniel the Bustagam. We are actually looking into Abraham. Did Abraham fast and pray at any time? Abraham, I'm praying. You both said you David and Abadan and Parayanundo. Did Abraham fast and pray? Let's look into the life of Daniel. There is something in Daniel which I want to show you. Uh, people call it the Daniel fast. Yeah, let's look into that verse. Hmm. Take that. Hmm. Let's look to verse 8 of chapter 1 first. Mama Yada Varne? Okay, we'll go to that. Let's look to chapter 1, verses 8. On Namathe Adhya, Daniel Ondindi Etta Sradhikya. Daniel decided in his heart that he would not defile himself with a portion of the king's meat or with the wine which he drank. Therefore, he requested of the prince of the eunuchs that he might not defile himself. Daniel felt eating anything outside his prescribed food was defiling himself. Okay. Now, this is something I want to ask you, church. How many of you really feel you have self-control when it comes to food? Sorry. I have to ask this. Bakshanate Kahanambol Soya Niyandra Mondan Vijayari Kinaturan. Some people are so controlled they won't eat anything. I cannot love it. Won't. But some people, I tell you, they had a heavy meal. Suddenly they saw the chicken curry. They will have one more meal. Or they will see fried fish. <laughs> okay, from tomorrow we will fast. Today the fried fish is there. From tomorrow we will fast. The next day it'll, you can be sure somebody will be making chicken 65. Okay, from day after tomorrow <laughs> such people need something called self-control. And the Holy Spirit wants to give self-control. Parishut Almava Self-control is an area where many people fall. It can be food today, it can be a girl or a boy tomorrow. Praise the Lord. Hallelujah. Yes, so people coming to Daniel, Daniel had a sure decision in his life. There was nothing wrong in the, what the king was going, giving them to eat. The, the king was also a man, he was eating the best food in the country. But Daniel said, I am not going to defile myself with the, uh, the food of the king. See what happened in his life. Daniel 1 9. Let's go down. Go to, uh, keep going down and see what happens. Okay. This is the temptation. And the prince of the eunuchs said unto Daniel, I fear my lord the king. Who has appointed your meat and your drink? For why should he see your faces worse li uh, liking than the children which are of your sword? Then shall you make me endanger my head to the king. What is the instruction that the king gave to the eunuch? Give them good food. So that they may become healthy. Daniel said, I don't want your prescription. I have got a better prescription. There is, a, there is a message for us tonight. When you fast and pray, do not conform to the image of other churches all around you. Why are you fasting? Find out a purpose for your fasting. Ningal Ningal So what we are going to do right now, I humbly request all of you to take a paper, your diary, a pen, your tablets, your iPads or your iPods or whatever. Write down what you want accomplished in the next 38 days or 32 days. Please make a list. 
write down what is it that you want ningalku endha vendathu that's it it's important please write down what do you want thank you jesus what is it that i i have already told even before the while this is going on i want a good church i want to move into a good church this is a good church but we are we are we are full we are full by the way talking about a new church how many of you uh, don't mind if this is a church with long benches neelamulla benchukal na thirikkunnundu kolappundo more people can sit that you can move around <laughs> write down at least seven things you want to want to accomplish during the fasting and if anybody wants a piece of paper let me know reena can get it for you from the from the other room from the baby's uh, sanctuary i think babies are not there rats i hope rats are not there write down what do you want seven things number one you can categorize this i'm trying to help you ningala sahayikan parayatha sahayam aavashyam undengil eduka categorize into spiritual things lord i need more gifts of the holy spirit enike parichitha aavinde koodal kubavarangale venam lord there is a pet uh, some some sin which i want to overcome which has been bothering me it can be a small malicious gossiping or some you know uh, some kind of a temptation in the body or some lust or something like that overeating or, or a weakness in some areas of the body whatever it is tell it to the lord eniki 30 20 40 sutrulle ende sharirathile jadathinte ende sharirathile chala karyangal ende endo chala chala bhoga priya bhakshanathodulla allekile angane chala weakness gal eniki sharirikamayittu kedugal undengil illathunna eniki oru vidudal venam write down spiritual areas first people of god aathmika karyangal ningal adhi eduthu then precious saints you can pray about your material needs a new job more finances coming out of debts whatever your issue is please write it down please write it down please write it down hallelujah last year imran got a wonderful job You got a baby too. Praise God. Amen.
Okay, are you done? Hallelujah. Praise God. Praise God. Thank you, Lord. Hallelujah. Jesus, hallelujah. We worship you. We worship you. We worship you, Jesus. Hallelujah. We thank you, Lord. We thank you. We thank you. We thank you, Lord. We thank you. We praise you. We praise you, Lord. Now, please remember, you can continue to add that. And remember, make sure that you stick on to this prayer need. Don't remove this. Don't change this once you get up from the prayer room. If you, for example, you are asking for a new church building, for a new church building, stick on to that. Don't move from there. We are going forward. Amen. 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 Daniel's life, we come back to Daniel's life and see, verse 11, see what happens. Daniel says to Melsar, who the prince of the eunuchs had set over Daniel, Hananiah, Mishael, and Azariah, verse 12, prove thy servants, I request you, 10 days, and let them give us pulse to eat and water to drink, verse 13. <laughs> Then let our countenances be looked upon before thee and the faces of your children that eat of the portion of the king's meat as you see, deal with your servants. So Daniel is taking a challenge. Daniel is telling his boss, you can give the king's meat to the rest of the people, but as for us, give us some pulse and some water for 10 days. Alpam berlalu untuk anda madi. Nyalang ladu guna dengan dalam. Baki orang orang kelilan, nihgal itu guna kanam. Nihgal lah. Okay. See what happens in verse 14. You already know it, but I want to say that verse 14. So he consented to them in this matter and proved them 10 days. Patu dua sam. Amin. Akhirnya telah mereka gitu. And at the end of 10 days, their countenances appeared fairer and fatter in flesh than all the children which did eat the portion of the king's meat. Patu dua sam kaya nasihat. Orang muka mereka aja bawa dengan kari cewa dengan segala bahalan maru di dalam, ada gula dum, abar mamsa bushtio lalu rendu kondo. There is a word for you here. Ini adalah tujuh bahagian yang penting. Amen. If you dedicate your life to the Lord in a special way, not only will you be spiritually strong, the Lord is promising you, you will get food you have not known so far. Ini baru yang nengal aranjung gula atau nengal reaja bawa atau nengal buci ke mana? Ippol nengal kata ane nama tinggal beli cipara. Ini baru duda. This is a word that God is giving. But are you ready to do it? When you are fasting and prayer, don't think you can mix the world, mix mix the kingdom and go on. Make some changes somewhere. Ia orang yang lembur beti asam berita. You will eat the king's food. Hallelujah. I want to tell you two stories, two things that happened during your fasting prayer. Number one, there was a man who never fasted. He wanted to fast. He was brought into a, a group of people who were fasting. He was, no, he was without food the whole day. Somehow he was struggling and struggling and struggling and all that. Finally, he went to sleep. That night, he had a dream. Jesus came to him, gave him all the food that he wanted. And he slept well. He woke up in the morning full. He went and told the pastor, I had a full meal. I am now satisfied. Bashar lah, hari ke pukul dua belas itu jadilah tu lembik ti. Idu waktu itu dua belas perhati ni kaya kat terkayari. Dua belas perhati ni kaya kat terkayari itu ni sesam. Pulik kaya dan tiri ni mar ni mel lah. Vida tu lembik dua belas. Ah hari ni kaya kaya diri tu asal orang yang orang kat terlebih serta pulik ni tu ni istimam malah bakshran kudu. And then he said, not only am I filled physically, he has blessed me spiritually also. The same thing has happened to me also in a particular situation way in India. Always remember when you fast, God will. Honor you. Ninggal leh dhar tu tuh ubah si cial. Dewi wan ninggal kendeng kelan tharim. Okay. What is fasting? Entah bu ubah asam. What is fasting people? Entah wan ubah asam. Patah ni ada ka. What is fasting? Who can tell me what fasting is? Entah wan ubah asam. What is your idea of fasting? Living in the presence of God, making sure the world or your flesh will not bother you so that you are ready to destroy the works of the devil. Pishad in the pravartikale adipan the kavannam logavum, ningal da shariravum, ningal kore anigraham ay tira takka reedhi il, ningal uboasikya nagatta vagreikin. If you want to really minister, it's good to fast. 
ശരിക്കും ശുശ്രൂഷിക്കണമെങ്കിൽ ഒന്ന് ബോസിക്കുന്നത് നല്ലതാ ഓക്കെ സം ഓഫ് യുവർ വർക്കിംഗ് ലെമി ടെൽ യു സംതിങ് സം ഓഫ് യുവർ വർക്കിംഗ് സം ഓഫ് യു ടെൽ മീ ദറ്റ് യുവർ സിക്ക് ബട്ട് ലെമി ടെൽ യു സിങ് ട്രൈ ഫാസ്റ്റിംഗ് ആൻഡ് സി നിങ്ങളൊന്ന് ഉപോസിച്ച് നോക്കിക്കേ ഒന്ന് ഉപോസിച്ച് നോക്കിക്കേ ലെമി ഗിവ് യു എ സ്മോൾ ക്ലൂ ഒരു ചെറിയ സഹായം പറയാം ലെറ്റ് സേ ലെറ്റ്സ് ടേക്ക് ദ വീക്കെൻഡ് ഓഫ് എയ്ത്ത് ആൻഡ് നയൻത്ത് ഫോർ എക്സാമ്പിൾ എയ്ത്ത് ഇസ് അറ്റ് ട്യൂസ്ഡേ ആൻഡ് വെനസ്ഡേ ദോസ് ഹു ഹവ് നെവർ ഫാസ്റ്റഡ് വൈ ഡോ ഡി ടേക്ക് ദീസ് ടു ഡേസ് എസ് ഫുൾ ഫാസ്റ്റിംഗ് എട്ട് ഒമ്പത് പാസ് ആനൻസൻ സാമൽ ഇസ് വിത്ത് ആസ് ദിസ് ഗൈ ഇസ് വെരി അനോയിൻഡ് ഓക്കെ വൈ ഡോ ട്രൈ ദാറ്റ് ഒന്ന് ശ്രമിച്ചു നോക്ക് മേ ബി ദോസ് ഹു ഹാവ് എ ഹൗ മെനി ഇഫ് യു ഹാവ് എ ഡയബറ്റിക് പ്രോബ്ലം ഡയബറ്റിക് ഇൻ ദിസ് ഇൻ എ പ്രോഡക്റ്റ് ചാനൽ ഉണ്ട് മമ്മി ഉണ്ട് മമ്മിക്ക് ഉണ്ടോ നോബഡി എൽസ് ഹാസ് വൈ ഡോ ഡി ഡു തിങ്സ് ഇൻ സച്ച് എ വേ ദാറ്റ് യുവർ ഷുഗർ ലെവൽ ഇസ് കെപ്റ്റ് അണ്ടർ കൺട്രോൾ ഇസ് ഇറ്റ് പോസിബിൾ ടേക്ക് സം എക്സ്ട്രാ ഷുഗർ ഓർ ഹൗ ഡു യു ഡു good think of some supplement that will keep the sugar level okay but make sure the, your 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 body your stomach is not full of all kinds of food ningala sugar level okay aguna reethil but there i'll tell you what will happen there your your tongue will attack you ningala naavu ningale aakramikkum you will miss your favorite food you will miss your favorite vegetable curry chicken curry fish fry all that taste is on your he'll keep telling you no no you're going to die you're going to die unless you partake of this taste you're going to die that is where you need the power of god want to try it etra varu shramicha kollavunnundu see i am a champion in fasting today nyan ee upavasathinte rashana but you know when i started this i could not even go without food for one time oru neram polu enikku upavasam irikkan enikku pattathilla i would feel hungry or my tongue would pull me to one side or my stomach would would pull me to one side or i would feel restless and all that one day i said lord i need help god said why don't you ask me i'll give you grace you can fast with grace krubayod ningal kubosikkan sadhikkum once you come out of it you'll be so strong now fasting is not a doctrine ubavasam oru upadesham alla you can go to heaven even without fasting ubavasikkade swargathi pogam but to fast and pray is the good discipline nallathu pol upavasichu prarthikkunnathu nalla oru discipline aanu did you know that there is a lust in the in the tongue navil jadamoham undo narkil aarilum thirichirnittundo yes lust of the lust of the flesh in the tongue navil jadamoham undagam see and the and the and the phone no bol ishtapattilla ad how do you break it engana break cheyyunne by not giving into the favorite taste etom ishtamulla taste onnu kalichengile have you seen how people are addicted to fish curry fish curry yeah meen curry fish curry you know how people are addicted people from kerala from where i come from they cannot live without fish curry they are addicted to fish curry yes is that is that true from people from pakistan i don't know you like it but you can live without it you don't need it every day no do you you need it every day oh. but people from kerala they cannot live without that fish curry and you know what they like it is not a fish they like the masala ആ അരപ്പിന്റെ രുചി ഇങ്ങനെ നാവിക്കിടക്കുക അതില്ലെങ്കിൽ ചത്തുപോകുന്ന പിശാചം എന്ന് പറയുന്നു വാട്ട് എവർ യു ലൈക്ക് എ ലോട്ട് ഗെറ്റ് റിഡ് ഓഫ് ദാറ്റ് ഡ്യൂറിംഗ് ദിസ് ടൈം ഓഫ് ഫാസ്റ്റ് നിങ്ങൾക്ക് ഏറ്റവും ഇഷ്ടമുള്ള ഒരു ഭക്ഷണം ഈ ഫാസ്റ്റിങ്ങിന്റെ സമയത്ത് അങ്ങ് വേണ്ട വെക്കാം വെക്കാൻ തന്റെ ഇടം ഉണ്ടോ യു വിൽ ഓ ഫിഷ് കറി ഓർ ലെറ്റ് ഇറ്റ് ബി എനി തിങ് ഓക്കെ മേ ബി യു ആർ നോട്ട് അഡി വാട്ട് അബൌട്ട് റൈസ് ഐ ചലഞ്ച് പീപ്പിൾ ഫ്രം കേരള ക്യാൻ യു ലിവ് ട്വന്റി വൺ ഡേയ്സ് വിത്തൌട്ട് റൈസ് അരി ആഹാരം ഇല്ലാതെ ഇരുപത്തൊന്ന് ദിവസം ഇരിക്കാവോ ഐ വിൽ ഗീവ് യു എ ക്യാഷ് സർട്ടിഫിക്കറ്റ് വെല്ലുവിളിക്കുക ഐ ക്യാൻ ചലഞ്ച് യു മൂന്നാമത്തെ ദിവസം നിങ്ങൾ പ്ലെയിൻ ടിക്കറ്റ് എടുത്ത് നാട്ടിൽ പോകും ദ തേർഡ് ഡേ യു വിൽ ടേക്ക് എ പ്ലെയിൻ ടിക്കറ്റ് ആൻഡ് ഗോ ടു കേരള ഐ നോ യു പീപ്പിൾ ഫ്രം ഇന്ത്യ കേരള ദേ ആർ ഇൻസെപ്പറബിൾ വിത്ത് റൈസ് people say in kerala homes people say at least one time you should have uh, rice 
Where is it said in the Bible? 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 These are all addictions, people. When you give up all these lifestyles, your minds will change. The Bible tells you in Romans 12, what does it say? Romans 12, what does it say? Renew your minds. It's psychological. Thank you, sir. It's psychological to think that you are not filled without rice. Icha hari hari orang kari cileng ini, ni ke, ni ane nonton kari cileng tu, orang ni lada, ada, ada psychology kila. Yeah, people in China, people in India, they are addicted to rice, rice, rice. I don't know about Pakistan. I think they are more into wheat, right? Chapati and things like that. Yeah. Huh? What's that? Keda? Yeah. Everybody has, has got some favorite food. People, I am telling you, I am requesting you during the time of fast. Tell the Lord, Lord, just give me some pulse and some water. It's a pyrum, it's a vellum. How many people can live with that? In fact, you should be you will be surprised. In fact, if you really take a radical step about your food, you will see such an attack on the whole body and it is not a medical problem. I'm telling you, yes. It is not medical, it's not a medical thing. If you go without your favorite food for three days, some of you get angry. You may even call me on the phone and tell me some things. Because you are so used to that comfort zone. Yes. I know a pastor's wife in Kerala. What she has been to America, she has been to Russia and all these places. But without rice, she is lost. One day I told her, I said, it is a bondage for you. And the How are you telling that the pastor's wife has bondage? What do you think? So you see, people can be so addicted to this during the time of fasting. Tell the Lord, Lord, I need a breakthrough. How many of you are at least 35 years here? Okay, 35 years old, at least 35 years old. Okay, did you know that your entire body is used to, Sarah is not 35, <laughs> she's only 25. <laughs> okay, at least, okay, 30 years old. Your body is subject to a particular kind of food for the last 30 years. And your carnal mind is also shaped according to that. Ningla Kadik in the Ahara Manasiricha, Ningada Jeda Manasum, Yuba Paton Riki, the Thor Korean. I'll show you a verse. You'll be surprised to see that. Read Hebrews 13. Ebrahar Padimun Nagata, there is a verse. I want the pastors kindly to help me. There is a verse. Do not fight about the food that you eat. Rather, your hearts are established by grace. There is a verse like that. Ningala Kadik in the Ahara and Sarichitala, Ningala Hrdeyangal, Kurbeyal, Urakate. Okay, let's let's uh, see where it is. No, 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 no. Hebrews, Hebrews, Hebrews. I'm talking about the kind of importance they gave to food in the first century. Did you get it? What sister? Ningal Rahirdayam Krubayal Belapatrikate. That's what she also said. Hebrews 9. Yeah, that's the one. Read that, read that. I'm gonna I'm gonna explain something. I got it. I got it. Chris, come. Give it to Uncle. Go. Give it to him. Good boy. Good boy. Let's read that. Let's go here. Be not carried about with different 
and strange doctrines. For it is a good thing that the heart be established with grace, not with meats, which have not profited them that have been occupied therein. You know what this verse means? In the early church, some people used to teach, your holiness depends on the kind of food that you eat. Ningal kadikin the aharatin answer chana, Ningal the Vishuddha Jeeva on the Padipikin or Rondairno. This writer to Hebrews tells them straight away do not be carried away with different and strange doctrines. It is a good thing that the heart be established with grace. Ningal de Hrdeangal, Krubeal Narete. Now, my question is Is the grace in your heart enough? To make you overcome every kind of lust in the flesh. I'm speaking bluntly. Sagela jeda mohateyum adi jivi kyo ala kruba namra krudeya tulondo. Think about it and answer. Answer to God. Don't worry about me. You you answer that to God. Do you have enough grace in your heart to make you overcome every kind of lust? Now remember, people like you, you don't have. Sexual lust, praise God. You are clean people, praise the Lord. You don't have, you know, lust for money. You are good people. But there are other areas which you know. For example, impatience. Lord, give me patience now. <laughs> Shall I tell you a secret why many people are struggling? Because they are not patient enough to wait for God. They are saved. This is not at any of you. I am speaking generally. They are actually waiting for things to happen today. They are not ready to wait for the time of God in patience. A man of God will come and say, Thus say the Lord today, tomorrow something else will happen. Today something is going to happen. I see something in the spirit. I see something. And people are pretty excited. Things don't happen. Stuck. Again, we need somebody to pick them up. They don't have patience. Shemaila. Whereas if you have patience, all you need is one man of God to tell you, there is going to be a deliverance. I know man of God. I believe that. Lord. Thank you. I don't want to hear anything more about it. God will deliver. Praise the Lord. Leave the topic and go forward. How many of you can get that grace? But because people have no patience, again they will pray, again they will pray, again they will pray. Man of God will come. They'll ask our directions. He will say something, maybe from the Spirit. Praise God. Again they will wait because they are impatient. Shema illa to the gunda. So people of God, let us ask God for for patience, the grace to hold on till God does. How many people want the grace to wait till God begins to move? God will do. He is promising and he is faithful to his word. He will do it. So what the problem with many people, as I said, is they are not patient. If God said specifically it will happen today, it will happen today. Till then we are supposed to have patience. Amen. Okay people, so these days, Daniels, let us take a decision to separate our bodies and our minds into a routine that we will be able to receive the word of God and we will be able to be on, on fire. Okay? We were going to pray and close. But before that, any questions that anybody has about what we learned today or heard today or about anything in general, we have five minutes. Please ask. I'm available to you for asking questions. When you go back home, please pray. We are really praying for a, a church. I want you to keep that in prayer. I have seen a couple of things. I am pushing it. I am praying for it. And uh, I will let you know when it is the right time. I will tell you. But keep praying, keep praying, keep praying. Any questions, anybody? About anything. If the Lord is equipping me, I will answer. Any questions, anybody? Any questions, anybody? Any questions, anybody? Any questions, anybody?
What Pastor Thomas has said that at this time, 637, because he's skipping lunch. He's skipping lunch. He has a weakness coming over him at around 637. He's already broken it, but we're going to pray for him right now. It is a spiritual attack. I am going through severe spiritual attack. Whenever I stand here and preach the word of God, I can see that. I can sense it. But God wants me to stand here and speak, preach the word of God. You know why I'm not, I hope the pastors understand, or Dennis also. I'm not taking help for translation because we want to stop it. Otherwise, it'll go on for, that's the reason. I want to value your time. That's actually a strain. strain. But I choose to stand here. We're going to break. So we'll pray for him. Anybody else, any special prayer request, anything regarding the fasting, I need a breakthrough. I need to fast. I need concentration. If there is anything on your body which is leading you to unnecessary sleep, unnecessarily getting into something, you need to break that. This is a time of deliverance also. Concentration. Yeah. As the Lord leads you, sister, you're free. You want to skip one meal? One meal. Two, two. It is between you and God. In this church, we don't have any rules like that. We want people to be free. We want people to be free in the Lord. Yes. Those of you who are working in the morning, I, if you don't already have a schedule, I can suggest something to you. Morning you have to work, so eat your breakfast. But then, or, uh, you know, once you come back, you can again eat something, keep the evening time free. So, uh, if you eat lunch, you're good. Those of you who are working in the night, any night shifters here? No, no night shifters are coming now. You know? Yeah, throughout the night, uh, Sister Jesse and all are working. In the morning, they come, they let them have a good meal, go to sleep, wake up, and then they can again fast. They can be without food. But the most important thing is saints, pray. 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 Keep on praying. Open your mouth wide and he'll give you a prayer. Okay, so let's pray for Pastor Thomas George. Any, any of you have a problem with your with your body right now we're going to pray for you you can come forward let's pray for the man of god right now heavenly father we pray for your servant we pray for your son lord i pray you will give him enough grace to fulfill the plans that you have for him your bible the word says the plans i have for you plans of good and not of evil to give you a future and a hope and lord at this time i pray that every attack that comes upon him at that 637 window will be broken in the name of Jesus. I thank you because no weapon that is fashioned against us shall prosper. Sometimes the weapons show themselves so that we can say greater glory of yours. I pray you will anoint him, Lord, these days. Anoint him for betterment. Anoint him for to be lifted up. Anoint him for, to do the work that you have kept ahead of him. I bless him right now in Jesus' name. Amen, amen, amen.